Linda Hopwood, pastor of Ives Chapel United Methodist Church. I have a question for you today. Is prayer your steering wheel or your spare tire? This is a quote from Corey Ten Boom. You may remember her story. She and her family were Dutch Christians who helped many Jews escape the Nazis during World War II by hiding them in a secret room in their house. When an informant tipped off the Nazis to the family's work, their home was raided and family members were imprisoned. Corey's sister died in a Nazi concentration camp, but Corey was miraculously released from the camp a few days after her sister's death. Corey went on to become an author of a number of books. A steering wheel is vital to keeping a car on the road. While a spare tire is critical in an, in an emergency, it also isn't something that typically we need every time we set out to go somewhere. If we translate this analogy to prayer, we need to pray constantly, every day, about everything, not just when we find ourselves facing an emergency. That's exactly what the Apostle Paul tells us to do. Philippians chapter 4, verse 6 says, Do not worry about anything, but in everything, by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Paul doesn't say pray about the big challenges we face in life or just pray about the things we can't handle on our own. Instead, he says we are to pray about everything. God's plan for us is for prayer to be the way we steer our lives especially if we remember that God is the one who is driving the car. There was a 1945 war film called God is My Co-Pilot. I've always thought that the movie was misnamed because God is the pilot, while we are the co-pilots or passengers. There is nothing too big or too small for us to bring to God in prayer. When we do that, we find we experience a sense of relief. We don't have to be anxious about something that we've brought before God. And that's something for which we can be extremely thankful. Amen. <music>